Definitely believe the people when they say Kava is better. Hey, 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 welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another vlog. Yes, I just finished washing my hair. I haven't washed my hair since I got my silk press, which was like... almost a month ago not too much not too much but i knew i didn't like by the time my silk press was like done i knew i wanted to get my hair done in like two and a half weeks and i don't wash my hair that often anyway so i'm like you know what let me just stick it out until it's time to do my hair so i'm doing a sewing on myself between today and tomorrow because i may not have enough time to do today but i did just want to come to the vlog and say hi i like to give y'all updates on my hair this is what my curls what is this oh that's my hair oh but this is what my curls is looking like i did cut my hair when i got my silk press so my fro is smaller but my curls are looking very healthy they looking good they looking good they looking good um so i'm about to blow my hair out braid it down and i have a couple of things to do today so for starters i if y'all remember i think like two or three vlogs ago when we're like three or four i had went to a baby shower the baby is now born and i have been given the honor of being the godmother this is my first gotcha out but anyway He's doing his newborn shoot today. He was born on the 21st of February. He's doing his newborn shoot today, March 2nd. And I'm going to go to the newborn shoot. And then afterwards, I'm going to Jersey to go visit my cousin. My cousin who had a wedding last year. I think it was, 20, I think it was 2022. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to go visit her afterwards. The newborn shoot is at 1.30. That'll probably be over by like 3. My lashes look crazy. I'm getting them done on Tuesday. Um, and then I'm going to drive up to Jersey. I'll probably get there like 4.30ish, 5. 5 is a drag, but definitely before 5. But yeah, probably get there around that time. And I'll probably leave there like 8 o'clock, 9. I ain't even going to lie. <sighs> then I'll be coming back home. Actually, by the time I come home... I might just finish my hair tonight. I could finish my hair tonight. But let's see. We'll see. If I do finish my hair tonight, I'll go to the gym in the morning. But I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, I just wanted to introduce the vlog. I don't really know what much else I'm getting into this weekend. I also need to pack. I do want to get that out the way because i am going to dc this weekend not this weekend next weekend and yeah so the vlog after this that y'all see that y'all will see will be a dc vlog so yeah i just want to get prepared for that because i hate doing stuff in between the week it's just between work the gym editing it just be too much child it just be too much so yeah i'm about to get started on my hair i'm going to watch the mia Culp culpa culpa movie like i'm gonna watch that tyler perry that's on netflix everyone's talking about it so i'm gonna watch that while doing my hair okay see y'all later so this is what we looking like right now fully blown out now we about to get into it so I'm not gonna watch Mia Culpa because or Culpa, whatever it's called, because Netflix is doing that household thingy, and I don't got time for that shit right now. So I'm on HBO Max, and I think I'm gonna start Pretty Little Liars. I've never watched it. If you watched it, comment down below. Let me know. Let me try to look normal for y'all. But if you watch Pretty Little Liars, comment down below. Let me know. Is it worth it? But I'm gonna start it. I see that it aired in 2010 but yeah we gonna watch this we gonna get started with this yeah i changed my mind i don't feel like watching this 
that's really what's delaying me right now. I need to find something to watch as I do my hair. Like, I can't do my hair and not watch anything. That's going to take forever. Ooh, I think I'm going to start succession. How many seasons? Four seasons? Yeah, let's watch that. regular braids yeah that's what it's given so the time right now it's like 12 o'clock i'm gonna leave my crib at like 1 30 because roosevelt fields is well oh, that's where the photo shoot is it's at roosevelt field that's not too far from me so i'm gonna leave my crib at one o'clock oh my eyes is burning nope oh. I'm going to leave at 1 o'clock. So it's 12 right now. I'm going to relax a little. I started watching The Wire instead. Succession was not wowing me. It was boring. Like, it wasn't good enough. Um, so I started watching The Wire. I'm going to stick with it. I'm going to relax until it's time to go. I'm going to throw a wig on and then finish my hair later. Um, And yeah. Baby. It's raining outside. Like, not even your average rain type of raining. Like, it's like dead ass raining. I hate driving in the rain, but I already made these two commitments, so gotta stick with it. My thing is, I look mad pale, but when he told me it was at Roosevelt Fields, thinking it's at Green Acres like I read Roosevelt Field but I'm thinking Roosevelt Field as like Green Acres so I'm like oh that's 30 minutes from me max Roosevelt Field is Long Island mind you I'm putting everything GPS Roosevelt Field Roosevelt Field to my cousin's house I'm putting it from Roosevelt Field and I'm like okay that's the that's the distance from Queens that's crazy but cool Long Island Duh. today I was like wait no Rose, like literally right before I took my nap I'm like wait no Roosevelt Field is Long Island I can't wake up at 1 o'clock <laughs> I can't get up at 1 o'clock um so yeah so I'm gonna get there like right 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 on time God willing hopefully traffic is not crazy etc but yeah I'm actually very excited I'm extremely excited I'm extremely excited so I'll see y'all in a bit it's raining so you know I gotta focus on the road 10 times more than I would on a regular I mean I like to focus on the road anyway but you know people start driving crazy when it's raining so I made it to the mall I hope the music in the back is not too crazy but yeah I made it to the mall first of all I had to fight for parking literally but I'm walking into JC Penny now I don't even know where to go I'm sure by the time I get there, the shoot gun damn near be done. Like, terrible. I need to stop being late. Hello, hello, hello. I'm back home. And look, my face looks like it's glowing or whatever. The lashes. Oh my gosh, so embarrassing. But anyway, I'm back home. Today was a pretty uh, successful day. 
Jace, he was not having it. Like, I think what it was, was that he he had like a little Easter, like an Easter bunny outfit. He was not feeling it. The hat on his head, he was not feeling it. But once he got swaddled, he was easy, breezy, beautiful. Um, so when we was leaving, again, previously I had bought him like a couple of things that's just been sitting in my trunk. So I transferred it over to the parents' car. As soon as I get home, because the day he was born, I had ordered him like something like really cute. As soon as I get home, mind you, it was supposed to deliver since like yesterday, the latest. It probably did deliver. But when I was leaving my house, the security wasn't at the security desk for me to check to see if I had a package anyway. So I come home. I'm like, let me see if I got a package. And it delivered. I'm like, hmm, perfect timing. But let me show y'all what it is. So cute. Okay, so I had got him this cute little board, which is one thing about me, everything educational. So it has his name, which is like puzzle pieces. So he's going to learn how to spell his name. It has like the shapes, the simple shapes and numbers. And it also comes with a stand. So like while he's a baby, it can just, you know, like stand up in his nursery. But when he's of age, he can be learning effectively. Okay. Hey y'all, so I actually just came in from the beauty supply store and I just changed my clothes and got comfortable. Um, so what I'm about to do right now is, I to say enough with the arm, okay? So what I'm about to do right now is actually take a, the kinky wig that I was telling y'all about earlier. I'm gonna take that, dismantle it, and then bleach the bundles and hopefully get started on my hair tonight. I know once I start my hair, I'm gonna finish. And I'm pretty, I'm I'm energized, I'm chilling. Like, I don't mind going to sleep at 1 a.m. Like, I'm not mad exhausted. Yeah, so, about to get started on that task. I'm about to put the wire back on. And, yeah. I did my hair I literally just finished doing my hair I think I started at like 9 30 it's 2 30 right now it didn't really take me like from 9 30 to 2 30 I took like a food break I was I was taking my time I curled it like I was I was taking my time so I did it in like a good good timing like I was taking my time so nonetheless the edges are sitting though. I need to find like a really good edge control for 4C hair. If you have any recommendations, please let me know. <sighs> Excuse me. So, I hear the weather in New York is really, really nice today. It's like 60 degrees. Time is currently 2.30. I think I'm about to get ready just to experience just a pinch of it. Excuse me, because I feel like by the time I'm done getting ready, it's going to be like almost four o'clock which is okay because the sun will still be out so 
let's go to Aldi. Finally going to Aldi. And I do need to go to Target to pick up some hygiene stuff. So I'm thinking about doing a hygiene haul. Let's see. But I'm really trying not to like spend too much or go over my budget this week. So there's that. But yeah, so let's get ourselves together because I know when I take these curls down, it's going to get <laughs> luscious. The lashes, oh, can't wait to get them. Yeah, I'm actually not going to go to Target today for a hygiene haul because I did want to film a video for you guys. So I don't want to like not buy everything because I'm budgeting this week. So we'll save that for when I do go. When I set aside my budget for that. So today we'll go to Aldi and I'm just going to get some groceries for this week because I really don't want to buy out much this week because I am planning on, not I'm planning, I am going to DC this week and so I'm just trying to save as much coin as possible and just trying to just cook more than buy out. So yeah we're gonna go to aldi we're gonna try not to spend more than uh 55 dollars i'm saying 55 but i see a number 70 in my head don't know why because i don't plan to spend that much i really just want to get groceries for this week but yeah let's go and i do really really do want to go to the mood i just want to do an activity for myself but i guess maybe just going food shopping is good enough i don't know we'll see but let me get myself together and i'll see y'all in a bit it's not that i don't want you The weather is so nice like I feel like I want to like 
lick the air like that's how good the weather feels like it's so real that i had to change my outfit i had on like a jumpsuit a flannel and the leather jacket that was in my zara haul and i walked kobe and i was hot i said oh we're gonna throw in a crop top a calm jacket and some jeans okay so i'm about to just put on some lip gloss but the lip gloss that i had bought i had bought it in a rush because i needed lip gloss to top my lip combo it's like a, a natural color but it leaves like a tint it doesn't really look nice without lip liner so that's what i'm doing right now this person next to me is trying to park but they gotta wait <laughs> at least i think they're trying to park either way they gotta wait oh i'm out of breath but this weather really just boosted mine like entirely this is the lip gloss by the way it's from ruby kisses i believe yes the jelly licious i usually like the pink one but this is like the brown one in caramel frappuccino it's not bad it just looks better with the liner boom i hope these people's not staring at me because that would be strange okay anyway we about to go to aldi i hope i have bags in my car now it's warm and shout out to the rain from, from yesterday for giving me a bomb ass car wash but yeah let's go if it wasn't for me planning this trip to dc i would definitely be outside today <laughs> definitely like a hundred percent it's mad nice yeah i'm excited i'm excited i just love nice weather like this just boosted my mood times a hundred and i was already so irritated from last night to today like i was just annoyed but this just boosted my mood i need to go for a drive take myself out i also may stop at sephora because i had got gifted this prada paradox for valentine's day and i already have prada paradox and the person who bought me the Par Pro prada paradox bought me it twice and um i'm like I already have this <laughs> and I have a lot as y'all can see because I used it earlier it's still a whole oh I forgot the bike is life niggas is gonna be outside today because the weather's nice if you know you know like if you from New York City Brooklyn Queens and the Bronx and Harlem I was gonna say you know the other two don't count but Harlem counts once the weather is nice the the guys with their bikes they be outside <laughs> they be outside this about to be prime time too what time is it 4 30 yep they about to be outside but anyway yeah so i have brought that bag oh i brought the bag with me because it's been in my work bag and being that i work in manhattan i just be telling myself oh yeah just stop at sephora in the city exchange it exchange it exchange it and i don't think it's giving that so maybe I Run the light. I'm already here. I hope the police wasn't there. <laughs> but yeah, so if I can go to Sephora, I will. I'm trying to think where there's a Sephora besides King's Plaza. King's Plaza is going to be a zoo. So I'm not even about to stress myself to go there. And I don't feel like going to downtown Brooklyn. So yeah but i do want to go to sephora if they have like any new fragrances that i may like i'll exchange it if not i'm just gonna buy stuff that i need and want from sephora so yeah so i just pulled up to chipotle and i am not ashamed because I am famished even when I buy groceries. By the time I buy the groceries, probably stop at Sephora. Do all this big shebang. 
I'm gonna be like on the brink of like starvation, okay? So I know if I get the Chipotle now, I can eat it now, I can eat it tonight, but I'm still gonna cook tonight so I can have something for work tomorrow. But I can't focus when I'm hungry. So I'm gonna just eat on my way to the spot. And then, um, yeah, I, I could I could food shop in peace. There's my bag. Let's grab my bag. Grab my phone and let's grab a Chipotle bowl. Hi, can I have a bowl with white rice? Hi, um, can I have a little bit of mild? A lot of corn. Wait, what's this um green? Yeah, I'll take some medium as well. Can I have a lot of corn, please? Oh, is, is there more lettuce? Okay. I'll take some, yeah, I don't want no cheese or anything. I'll take some more corn though, no corn. And then I'll take sour cream on the side. Thank you. Yes, please. First of all, maybe I'm late to the game or they was just trying to run game. But since when Chipotle charged for vinaigrette? Like, since when do they charge for vinaigrette? Can I have vinaigrette? She said, that'll be $1.91, please. $2? $2 in a cup don't even be full? Yeah, okay. Get out my face. I kindly just walked away. Go give that vinaigrette to somebody else. Somebody else whose face you could play in. Not mine. <sighs> I didn't get any cheese on my bowl. I did get a side of sour cream. But I ain't got no cheese, so that's good. Definitely believe the people when they say kava is better. This is the Bev I picked up. Certified organic lemonade. Let's see if it's good. This man watching me eat. You want some, sir? Because this is the most money I'm spending on food all week. I'm gonna even see if I can get me some breakfast stuff, like for real. Let's see. Oh, this lemonade is good. It's good. It's good. I don't know how much it costs, but it's good. I'm about to sit here, eat my food a little, make a little dent in it. Okay, so we just parked up. First of all, the skin is glistening. I didn't even flat iron my hair i just hot combed it <laughs> so it keeps sticking up looking crazy but anyways i know with aldi aldi however you say it you need a quarter to use the cart i usually have coins in this bag but for some reason i feel like <gasps> i have a quarter i have a quarter you do give the quarter and you do get it back i think you just asked for it back at the register but I'm happy I have a quarter because I feel like I'm gonna need a car. I'm excited. Let's go to Aldi. Aldi. And my battery is dying, but look. Wait, hold on. What are we looking at? I didn't bring my extra battery. It's because I didn't pack. Oh, never mind. And did yes I did yes I did see don't doubt yourself I was about to blame myself like no it's because I didn't pack my bags as soon as I put all my stuff together I should have packed my bag but I got the battery and I got my tripod to hold y'all up like I'm prepared today all right let's go so you put your quarter in boom and it detached from the thing My camera bugging out. I don't know how I lost the screw between there and now, but I did. But good thing I have like a whole pack of screws at home. Mm. 
Oh, Aldi drained me. They didn't even have that much stuff. I'm gonna show y'all everything I got when I get home, but they didn't have that much stuff. And it's definitely clipped for Sephora. Aww. Yeah, it's definitely clipped for Sephora. Simply because there's no Sephora over here. If there was, I'd make the move, but there's not. And tonight, I'm still going to cook. I bought some salmon. It's not gonna extend that far, but it's something. I got something basically to eat every night this week. Like, I should not be buying out food anytime this week. If I do, it'll be breakfast because like I was probably just running too late in the morning. So I'm gonna go home. I'm going to cook tonight. Excuse me. And I need to edit excuse me i'm behind on vlogs but i definitely need to edit so yeah i will see y'all some lady came outside with a dress okay she said i am enjoying today's weather but yeah i'm gonna see y'all when i get home I'm trying to think what else do i have to do that's really it just cook and edit yeah and I need to start I already wrote everything down in my phone what I need to pack for DC not everything but most things that I need to pack so I'm gonna get started with that this week so I will see y'all later all right y'all so I'm back home let me show y'all real quick everything that I got from all these all these I gotta look up how to really say it mm, no. um so I'm gonna start with whatever's over here first so I got me some everything bagels because in the morning I be ordering or well, recently I started ordering like everything bagels again. We're not ordering. We're making bagels every morning. Fry some egg real quick. Take 30 seconds. Throw that on. Throw some butter. And call it a day. Next I got some frozen strawberries and I also got some bananas. Going back to making my smoothies in the morning. I picked up this raspberry vinaigrette. I don't think I've ever purchased raspberry vinaigrette, but I think I've tried it before. Anyway, I hope that I like it. This was like two something because this is the Aldi brand, so it wasn't expensive. Damn, my lashes look so embarrassing. Got me some fig bars. They're not fig Newtons because fig Newtons is the brand name. This is Benton's. Um, they all taste the same to me if you ask me but I got these if I need anything to snack on because again we're not spending any money this week so I got these if I need anything to snack on that's like one of my favorite snacks call it geriatric if you please I got a pack of um, instant oatmeal this was like a dollar something because it's the Aldi brand I picked up these mini vegetable samosas samosas yeah so i love the trader joe's ones so let's see what these is hitting for i also picked up this is something new chicken momos from nepal so hopefully these is good too does it come with the sauce they're basically dumplings mm -hmm. oh yes and it comes with a sesame dipping sauce Next thing I got is this mac and cheese. So this is a truffle and porcini mushroom mac and cheese from the Aldi brand as well. It looks really, really good. I only got two boxes and the, I would have gotten more flavors, but I'm also trying not to consume dairy. And the rest of the flavors that they had was like Gouda cheese, three cheese, the truffle. I could deal with that. Next, I got some mixed greens. This was also inexpensive. It was like $2.00. But the box is also not that big. Then I got some salmon. This was kind of expensive. $9. And it's not even a whole pound. It's 0 .99 pounds. So it's not even a whole pound yet. But it's fine. This should be enough for tonight and lunch tomorrow that's really what i really care about then i got these chicken patties these... but i heard kobe then i got these frozen chicken patties there's like how much is in here it's a couple in here so <laughs> listen i make a chicken patty and bring it to work okay throw some mixed greens on there call it a day 
Got some almond milk to put in my smoothies and some iced oat milk cookies. I haven't had these in so long. This is another thing that I'm just going to bring to work and leave just in case I need to snack like because I be needing snacks at work. So that's pretty much everything that I got from Aldi. I total in total I spent $52, which is not bad. I don't think it's bad. Um yeah, so let me what do I have to do? I'm not gonna cook right now. I'm gonna relax right now, watch the wire. I'm gonna see if I could watch the wire and edit at the same time. Or maybe not watch the wire, just edit. <laughs> but I'm definitely gonna see y'all before I close out this video, okay? Ciao. I done fell asleep better than. Ain't cook a meal, ain't do nothing. But fell asleep. It's 10.40. Oh, what now? I'm I'm about to, um... I'm not even about to make the salmon tonight. I might as well just make it tomorrow, but I'm about to. <sighs> so tired from what? <clears throat> but I'm about to make one of those box macaroni and cheeses. I'm not even hungry tonight. I'm gonna just make it and pack it for tomorrow. I ain't got no, no sides, no protein, no nothing to eat with it but I need to pack lunch, so there's that. I can't believe myself falling asleep like that. It makes sense though, because I've been up since like 7 a.m., no nap. Baby, okay. But, um, yeah, if I don't come back to show y'all what it looks like, then that'll be the end of this vlog. I love you guys so much, and I will see you all in my next video.